What's going on guys? Yesterday, Chris Weidman finally got back into the win column after all this time, but unfortunately, it didn't come without its controversy. Weidman was winning the fight up until he accidentally eye-poked his opponent, as you can see in the picture above, and Weidman ended up TKOing his opponent on the ground, and it seemed like the fight was originally going to go to a finish in Chris Weidman's favor, but later, it was turned over to be a unanimous decision. Whenever there's an accidental eye poke or some other type of illegal move that ends a fight accidentally, what happens sometimes is the judges will score the fight based on how it was going up until the point of the illegal strike. So it's not uncommon for us to see decisions long before the total time elapses of the fight. However, it's not very common for fights to end by a unanimous decision in the middle of the fight after one fighter got finished as a result of the illegal strike. As you can see on the screen, Chris Weidman was winning the fight pretty convincingly going into the third, and they just decided to give the win to Chris Weidman anyway, even though the fight technically ended as a result of an illegal strike. Do you guys agree with the decision by the UFC to give Chris Weidman the win here? Honestly, I think I kind of do. And the reason why is because Weidman was winning the fight pretty convincingly up until the illegal strike. And realistically, the strike was accidental at the end of the day. What do you guys think?